Hey there everyone, my name is JW and welcome back to the channel. Today I've got another awesome tank tutorial video for you. But first, I have to mention the Tanky Art slash Discord server. Are you interested in receiving a shout out and being a part of a growing community? Well, look no further than the Tanky Art on the JW channel. Just join the Discord server, link is in the description. And find the Tanky Art section and enter either your Java, Bedrock, Xbox, PlayStation, or Nintendo Switch gamer tag, and you'll be entered into the Tanky Art with these lovely other folks. So come on in, come join, we're all fine, everyone's fine. With that said, Let's get into today's tutorial. Today we'll be building this, the Media Mark A Whippet. Uh, British World War One, I, I guess, medium tank with uh, four machine guns. Um, not really how to consider a medium tank, but that's Britain for you. All right, let's get into it. So we're head down to Britain here. Here we are. Go down the line a bit. And here we are, the Media Mark A Whippet. It's a fun little tank so let's get right into it so today you'll be needing polish and light wall stone brick stairs stone brick slabs green concrete smooth quartz slabs red nether brick slabs stone slab stone stair and andesite wall all right let's begin we shall begin right here one two three one two three and one two three a total of nine skip three and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. All right, right here we're gonna put slab, slab, and slab, slab. Now remember, folks, if I'm going too fast for you, remember you can always pause, rewatch, rewind, and do whatever you need to do to get this awesome tank into your world. Let's just continue. All right, so with that down, let's put some placeholders down. Put two placeholders right here. One stone brick slab there, and one stone brick slab there. And on the front, we're going to put one, two, two more placeholders, then slab, and slab. There we go. Next, we're going to put a green concrete block right there, followed by stone brick stairs right there. And then right here, we're going to do one, two, three, and four. Again, one, two, three, and four. And then we're just going to connect the slabs up top, all the way back to right here. So that will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. All right. Track section is complete. You can get rid of those materials. We're going to come to the front of the vehicle and put two bricks, two quartz slabs like that with one red in the middle underneath. And above, we're going to do a placeholder slab and then bring that over and then one over just like that. Then inside, we're gonna come in and fill in the floor and bring it back. And there we go. We're gonna bring it to right here and then one, two. And then one, two, three. And this is gonna go all the way around. Just like so. So you have that. All right, so next we're gonna put stone stairs right here. And did I forget a material? Uh, apparently I did. We're going to need a block of coal. So one, two, three, four, five, six. The engine's going to go right there. So then we do one, two, three. And cover that up. Then here, one, two, three, four. Now I should cover that up. Then we're going to build the crew fighting compartment. So we're going to one, two, three, four. And bring that off. You can fill in the floor here and do that. Then fill that in, and then we're going to put another row of stairs here. Right here, andesite wall there, and andesite wall there. This side, we're going to put two slabs right here. We're going to put one concrete block there, and a stone stair, and wrap it, and wrap it good like that. And then we're going to put a full block here and here and bring down across. Full block there. Put a stair. Full block. Stair. Full block. Stair, stair. And full block. And then one slab. And there we go. There's the fighting compartment. Let's do a general look around. Show you guys how it's supposed to look. There we go. There we go. And there we go. And that should do it for the main building materials. 
So next we're going to switch over to our cosmetic materials, which is going to be end rod, iron trapdoor, spruce trapdoor, chest. Wait, I used a chest on this? No, I did not. We don't need a chest. I don't know why I put that in there. Confusion. Ladder, flower pot, dried kelp block, barrel, spruce door, and gray carpet. The gray carpet's going to go right on these green blocks here. Your spruce door is going to go on the back. Your barrel is going to go right here, followed by your kelp block. Just some compartmental storage. Going to put your flower pots here. Ladder right on the coal blocks. There we go. Let's grab the rest of our materials, which will be spruce sign, dark oak wood buttons, and polished blackstone buttons. All right. So we're going to put our spruce signs right there and one on the back. Same on the other side. There we go. And our spruce trap doors, we're going to put two right there, then one, then one. And again on this side, two, one, and one. All right. So next we're going to put car, uh, put spruce trap doors there. And we're going to put one right here. There we go. Then iron trap doors. We're going to do one, two, three, four, like so. And there's another material we forgot, which is green carpet. Green carpet's going to go here and here. Back to the iron trap doors. We're going to do one, two, three. One, two, three. There we go. And we're also going to put a spruce trap door right there. All right. Now we're going to put an iron trap door right there and right there. Next, our end rods. We're going to do one, two, three, four. There we go. And then one and two. There we go. Now these little bits on the front are not machine guns, they're just uh, helps with the tracks. Speaking of tracks, we're going to switch our dark oak wood buttons and put them on the treads. There we go. And then you're, we're going to place your polished blackstone buttons on any flat surface you can find. Just like so. And there you have it, folks. You, I believe, you have successfully completed the Media Mark A Whippet, French, uh, British World War One uh, medium tank. I almost said French, and I would have been uh, expelled for that. But I did it. I said British. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys like this video, please hit that like button wherever you're going to move to. Hit that subscribe button as well. I will in addition to my Wunderbar bundle for subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much for doing what you do, liking, subscribing, and sharing, and all that. It really means a lot to me. It means a lot to the channel. It means a lot to the community. Speaking of the community, don't forget to join the Discord server. Link is down in the description. Come join us. We love having new people. We love seeing new faces. And we'll always be happy to see new people and new faces. So if you want that, remember to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.